Hello everyone. Welcome to the YouTube channel of Triponet. My name is Manoj. Today, let us understand about surface roughness parameters. What are the surface roughness parameters? The first one, mean line of the profile. Second one, arithmetic mean deviation, which is RA. Third one, root mean square deviation, RQ. Fourth one, skewness, RSK. Fifth one, kurtosis, RKU. Let us study one by one and understand what are they. First one, mean line of the profile. It is denoted by small letter m. It is the line with the shape of geometrical profile and it runs parallel to the profile. The mean line of the profile is determined by the sum of square deviations from this line which is the smallest. The figure 2 shows the indication of the mean line small letter m in the surface roughness profile. Here we can see the red line which is the mean line. Second one, arithmetic mean deviation which is RA which represents the arithmetic mean of the absolute ordinate that is z of x within the sampling length. One of the most widely used parameters which is the mean of the average height difference for the average surface. It provides for stable results as the parameter is not significantly influenced by scratches, contamination and measurement noise. In this figure we can see the indication of RA in the surface roughness profile and RA formula is given by 1 by L limit of 0 to L Z of X of DX. Here we can see the indication of RA in the surface roughness profile. Third factor root mean square deviation which is RQ. It represents the root mean square of Z of X within the sampling length. This is one of the most widely used parameters and is also referred to as the RMS value. The parameter provides for easy statistical handling and enables stable results as the parameter is significantly influenced by contamination, scratches and measurement noise. The figure 4 shows the indication of RQ in the surface roughness profile. Here RQ is given by square root of 1 by L limit of 0 to L Z square of X into DX. Here in this figure we can see the representation of RQ. The next factor is Qness which is represented by RSK. The quotient of the mean cube value of Z of X and the cube of RQ within a sampling length. This parameter concerns height distribution. It is suitable for evaluating the abrasion and oil sump of lubricants for slight planes. The figure 5 shows the indication of RSK in the surface roughness profile and the formula for RSK is given by 1 by r cube to the cube the whole bracket 1 by l in the limit of 0 to l z cube of x dx here we can see how the rsk variation is found in the surface roughness profile rsk is lesser than 0 and rsk is greater than 0 the probability density graphs are given the next factor is kurtosis which is represented by rku this is a quotient of the mean quadratic value of z of x and the fourth power of rq within the sampling length. This parameter relates to the tip of geometry of peaks and valleys and is suitable for analyzing the degree of contact between two objects. Here in the figure 6 which shows the indication of rku in the surface roughness profile and the formula for rku is given by 1 by rq to the power 4 whole bracket 1 by l in the limit of 0 to l z to the power 4 of x dx here we can see the probability density graphs of rku which is greater than 3 and lesser than 3 i hope from this video you understood the surface roughness parameters which are mean line of the profile arithmetic mean deviation root mean square deviation skewness factor and kurtosis these are the references for the information provided in this video and thank you for watching this video and to get more details on the topics related to tripology follow us on our social media pages on Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn and do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel Tribonet. Also visit our website on www.tribonet.org.